Hi everyone, Dennis Foley from Acoustic Fields. Today we're going to talk about the kick, the bass, and the war that they both have with the room. So kick drum frequency response, 50 to 80 hertz, right in that frequency range. Bass guitar, 40 to 400. So you see a lot of overlap here. Whenever you see overlap, you've got twice the problem. Okay? And if your room is not set up to handle one problem, now you got two. So wavelengths don't fit in the room. So you're going to have, like I said, the shared frequency here. So you're going to have two sound sources with the same frequency. 40 hertz is 28 foot long. No room's that long that we see. 50 hertz, 22 foot sometimes, but very seldom. And that's only in one dimension. But remember, we have three sound fields, width, height, and length. So we have to make sure we have the appropriate treatment for that. We have room modes in all three sound fields. Are you hearing both clearly? We have a lot of songs uh, that we use for testing, and there's a lot of songs that have good bass and good kick at the same time. But getting your room to allow them to separate, that's the key. The recording's good. You know, you can hear both of them in the recording. You put on headphones. But when you play them back in your room, can you hear them with the same definition, separation, attack and decay rates that they need to have? Are you hearing both clearly or... Excuse, <clears throat> excuse me, the term we like to use is mud and soup. Because that's what it sounds like when you get wavelengths, you know, that don't fit and the same frequency. It's hard to separate the two. That's really important. So what do modes do? They exaggerate or attenuate. You hear too much, which is bloom or, you know, bass boom, people call it. Or attenuate, you don't hear anything at all. Not so much the case with low frequency energy. Okay? The treatment is absorption, not diffusion. 50% surface area coverage. We go back to our acronym TAP, type amount position. We have to have about 50% coverage in all three sound fields if you're going to control it. The floor to ceiling dimension is that standard 60, 70, 80 hertz problem. That's a low frequency, that has to be treated. People forget about the floor to ceiling dimension all the time. They get width and length, but they need to look up and see what's going on floor to ceiling because that's a big factor. We're going to use absorption. We're going to use low frequency, and we're going to need about 50%. Our ACDA series and our carbon panel series are five foot in height for a reason. Because in North America, where we work mostly, ceilings are eight feet. At five feet, you're, you're making that 50% minimum requirement. And that's what you got to have, we found over the last 17 years, to have a real big impact on the low end. To make you feel like, you know, the money you spent to get that has worth, been worth it. You know, a panel here, a panel there is not going to do it. We found the ratios are about 50% surface area coverage in all three sound fields, floor, ceiling, width. So you got to keep those sound fields in mind because bass is a pressure wave which just fills the room like water. Tear off the roof, pour water in your room. That's bass. Pour maple syrup. We used to use that example. What's it do? It goes in the middle, fills to the boundary surfaces, and then rises. That's what low frequency energy is. It's a good way to visualize it. So make sure your kick bass aren't fighting your room and the way you interject between that war is the proper treatment. Hope this helps. Thank you. Thank you for watching this video, and if you liked it, please give us a thumbs up. We also have a newsletter that you can subscribe to, so please do that because we offer special price discounts to only those on our newsletter. And then don't forget about our forum. We have started a forum on our own website where people ask questions, and I usually get a chance every couple days to look at it. There's an interchange between people on the forum, and we'll give you real answers uh, on a regular basis, so that'll help you. Thank you.